I'm here with Hunter from Clever Man. Elevator pitch, Clever Man. Oh, mate. It's a, <laughs> it's a set in the close dystopian future where a new species of people have come out, traditional species called the Hairies, um, and society has to deal with the other. But who's balancing that all out is the traditional Clever Man superhero. Moi. <laughs> Harry's, <laughs> Harry's, yeah, right. What a, what a, what a cool name, right? Look, it's 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 something that's that's derived from from stories to stories to stories. They've had so many other names. They have traditional names, and we just thought, look, we've got to give them a generic, universal name that everyone can relate to. Yeah, that's gonna stick in my brain. That ain't gonna exactly. change. So exactly. So in terms, of, as mentioned, so you're like the the hero, right? Yeah. So what is what does being a hero entail for you as clever man? Oh man, it, it it it's it's with great power comes great responsibility. Of course, <laughs> trademark. Of course, trademark. But um, <laughs> but look, we, I think I think my my clever man, my character, Colin West, he, he ain't he ain't happy. He, he ain't a good guy. He, <laughs> like I think I think I'm actually still hated. Like an <laughs> anti-hero sort yeah, of thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's a, he's a classic anti-hero. So so I feel like you know his his responsibility with culture and stuff like that is times ten. Because he's already an anti-hero, yeah. you know, someone like that. That's you know, a superhero with their responsibility is fine because of powers and their family and stuff like that. But then when it's a cultural aspect as well, and it's like it's like Avatar. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's like it's like Ang Ang can't just be Ang. Ang's got to look after the spirit world and the human world. Stressful. Yeah. Ex exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And that and that and that is my clever man. He's 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 a stressful, flawed. Pain in the ass sometimes, but he knows what to do, but not accurately. It's like a little Danny LaRusso type thing. It's like flawed superheroes are like the, just the thing right now. We're talking like Deadpool and whatnot. So like, you're in the right alley there. I'm 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 doing. I think I'm doing well. I'm doing well enough where because you know they're making a lot of Star Wars films lately as well. So. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping to be a Jedi one day. Yeah, get on the boot. Yeah, get on that. So, so hopefully, you know, by doing Clever Man, I'm being a part of the same type of industry. Like, but what if what if Clever Man becomes its own big like franchise and its own like massive universe? Well, then then that's a different story, man. If Clever Man becomes its whole, whole universe, we're gonna turn it into like an Aboriginal X Men thing and just and get more. I would one hundred percent say that. Right? How dope would that be? How like, dope would that be? You sold me. I'm gonna make it happen. Yeah. <laughs> It's exciting. <laughs> all right, exciting so where, times ahead. <laughs> so where can we all see, see Clever Man? You can see it on uh, you can see it on Amazon. You can see it on Apple TV, iTunes. You can grab it in Australia on Blu-ray and DVD. If you're in New Zealand and the UK, you can uh, binge watch it on BBC Three. If you're in the States, you can binge watch it on Netflix. Yeah, there's there's places to find it. Google it. <laughs> I certainly will. I'm Ryan Betts, and that's Hunter from Clever Man. Lovely Thanks, to man. meet you, man. Thank you very Have much for your one. time. Thanks, brother.